This is another in my series of fun with the LSM-303 magnetometer. This thing is, is pretty neat. Uh, this time I have it uh, hooked up uh, by the actual USB rather than through the, the tiny ISP term. So I'm just going to go plug that in now. And uh, the other neat thing there is you can actually, I don't know if you can see it, but it's getting around 812 frames per second, which is absolutely spectacular compared to the less than 30 I was getting before. And that's 812 magnetic readings a second. So I have it sitting on my keyboard, and uh, let's just make sure you get the, the thing right here. I have a magnet in my hand. It's a neodymium, uh, just probably a three-quarter inch by about a quarter inch diameter magnet. And um, I'm going to just hold this in my hand like that. I'm going to reset calibration um, and uh, just kind of get some basic calibration data here. Uh, I guess I have to flip the y-axis. And um, now that I have kind of the, the range that I want to go in, I can stop calibrating and I have a joystick. While it's talking through USB, it's not a HID device yet, but um, as you can see, it's, it's pretty robust. Um, it gets a little hokey every now and then, but um, I can just kind of go around the range that I'd ordinarily go, and uh, I can, you know, control it like a normal joystick here. So, uh, yeah, I don't know. I thought it was pretty cool. I don't know. What do you guys think? Just being able to have a joystick uh, anywhere with nothing more than a little circuit board and a magnet rather than having to haul around a whole actual joystick. So, I thought it was cool. I hope you guys did too.